Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario, and in this episode, which, uh, make sure to watch the one before, it was uploaded on the same day as this, uh, I'm gonna be showing, first off, all of the star panels that we can get, or the, the panels with the star pieces that we can get, uh, now that we have the two boots. So these are all the locations of the places we've already been that we can get, uh, the star pieces, uh, at least at this point. Um, so that's all of Toad Town, here is Pleasant Path. So yeah, there's a ton of star pieces, again... Uh, a lot, a lot of the ones you don't get from Chuck Quizmo or Koopa Coot or um, um, uh, the, the letters you get from panels. Some of them are just random, just randomly sitting there. But a lot of them, and that's uh, Goomba Village. That's the place where we first found Mario. That's behind Goomba Village or June Troopers Playground, Dry Dry Desert. Um, most of these are pretty obvious where they are. And um, but uh, most of them, besides the ones you get from all those other things, uh, you get from the panels. Um, the other thing is, um, when I go to get badges this time, uh, from, from, uh, M Merlove, or Mer Merlot, uh, I will have a other star pieces, that's from, uh, Chiquismo, I did a few runs of that, but again, I'm showing those all later. Um, the other thing is, because of the Shy Guys, you can't access the badge shop, so I will be showing getting badges during Chapter 4, since I can't, uh, do that now, and you'll, obviously you'll know why I can do that. Uh, because, uh, there's a lot of backtracking and tracking in Chapter 4. Um, in this, uh, with Koopa Koot, I'll only, only be doing the first, the two, first two I can do of this, uh, his missions. I'll do the other one with the other three after Chapter 4, because one of them involves cooking and you can't use Taste Tea at this time. Uh, same with the radio thing. You can technically do the radio, uh, contest, but you can't do that. It's, you have to cook something, and you can't do that until after, uh, you, you, uh, get Taste Tea back to able, after Taste Tea is able to cook again. Um, so the first thing is, you have to tell, uh, read the sign, uh, by Merlon's house. I didn't show that because it's kind of not, there's no point to doing that. Or no point to showing you because it's pretty self-explanatory, but just read the front and back of Merl uh, sign in front of Merlon's house. Uh, here, you have to buy him a, Mer a life room, which is 50 coins. You can get in, uh, Boo's Mansion. Um, it's, it's not, I, it, I, I recommend A, that you do this beforehand, but it's kind of sucks that you have to pay 50 coins for it, but... You do get three star pieces for this one, as you'll see. Oh wait, no, no, not three star pieces. You get uh, the gold credit, which is the second credit for the playroom. I'm not sure. I think it allows you to play another game in the playroom. I think is what it does. Like it's similar to all the cards from TTYD. Um, I, I'll be showing the playroom off later too. Uh, here we have that panel in uh, Rougeport. Or Rougeport. This isn't Rougeport or, or Rogueport. It isn't Rougeport either. Um, Toad Town Sewers, we have, uh, that panel which will get us to this area with, uh, Dark Koopas. Um, I think they're called Dark Koopas in this game. Yeah. Uh, they're not too bad to kill. Um, I think if you wait too long, they'll end up using it. are they, maybe that's in TTYD though, they'll end up using a Dizzy Tack on you, that might be TTYD though. I don't know. Anyway, let's just, uh, kill these guys, they're not too difficult, they're just, again, more stronger to Koopas for the most part. Uh, unless you star storm. Um, at one point, eventually, I'll use a couple. I'll show a compilation of all the star spirit powers. But for now, I'm just going to be showing them as uh, which ones I want to show. I would show them each time I get a star power, but I haven't done that so far, and it's I don't really. I'll just do it all at the end because I can. Um, so uh, in the meantime, oh. I'm back off of spring break at this point. I'm recording this before off of being spring. Ah, I'm recording this at home still, but um, I'm gonna be off at spring or I'm gonna be back at college by the time you see this video. Uh, working on more animating and just you know, uh, it's, it, you know, college is, is good. I like being at college overall. It's it, I mean, at home I have to share the house with uh, six brother or six brothers, four brothers. Um, and that can get, you know, kind of annoying at times. Hey, there's there's positives and negatives to being home. Like, A, you get really good cooking at home. You get to relax. You know, there's no stress. But there's also, you know, a little bit of independence at uh, college that you don't get at home. It's nice. Uh, so after killing all the Dark Koopas, we get a, a, a switch, uh, which will have a pipe. And not to the left is an area we don't need access to because there's a super block. And as you see, we have all our partners powered up. So there's no reason to use a super block. Um, but that's, that blue pipe will lead to Boo's Mansion, um, so if you want a shortcut there, 
Um, here I'm buying some badges. I have 40 star pieces. So yeah, I got a lot of star pieces from those panels and from also Chuck Quizmo. Um, but as you see, a lot of them cost a lot, so it's not going to get me a ton of badges. Um, I thought I cut some of that out. Uh, so here's the money money badge that will allow you to get more money I, d I don't put that on yet though because it costs so many badge points it's almost like I want to use it but could you like you know let me have you know ha cost less you know cost less badge points um what else do I get I think the zap tap yeah I get the zap tap which will definitely come in use uh, I definitely recommend at some point you get the zap tap. You could have probably even got it earlier, and it definitely would, uh, as people pointed out, uh, work for the fuzzies in the forests um, for reasons that are pretty apparent if you know what it does, which is it makes you, it's basically the, the use of a fault shroom, but it's permanent. Um, zap tap is actually quite good. I recommend having it. Um, here is the dojo uh, for this part. Remember, I use one every, I'm going to show one every uh, after every chapter. This time I'm fighting Lee. Lee is a du uh, duplicate. I think it's Duplicate. I call it Doppel Ghost, but I think it's Duplicate Ghost, as in Duplicate, not Doppel, because you don't duplicate, at least to my knowledge. Anyway, he copies, uh, he's a Duplicate Ghost, and he copies, uh, the moves of, um, uh, your partner. He copies wh whatever form your partner takes. Uh, so, um, he took Bombette's form, but honestly, like, this battle was really easy. Uh, it really wasn't that hard for a few reasons. A, because I got the zap tap on, that helped. And more importantly, um, I used Bombette's bomb and body slam. But, uh, uh, Lee isn't that. I think it's Lee. Yeah, it's Lee. The Chan was the buzzy build. Lee's not that hard. Okay, now it's time to show, I believe, after I get the second degree card, um, it will be time to show all of the, uh, uh, the shy guy stuff. So here's what happens when you leave for the first time from Forever Forest. Uh, shy guy stole a frying pan. That sucks. Uh, here we have a shy guy uh, interfering with the train. So you can't use the train until you kill that shy guy. Here we have a shy guy stealing a shop key. That's not good. Why? Why do you need a storm key to use your keep your business in? in uh, why do you need to keep your business? running. You don't even... That lock has been locked since the beginning of the game. What have you... I mean, I guess maybe you've locked it and unlocked it. I don't know. Uh, Shy Guy stole a calculator. Shy Guy is trampling the gardens. So you can't give her the C that we got from Forever Forest until we kill these Shy Guys. So let's kill them. Maybe. Come on. Hama! Bama! There we go. The flowers will give you your th their thanks, Mario. Let's give her, her our seed. The seed we got from the Babalbs, not, don't be, not that kind of seed, if that's what you were thinking. Th that was horrible. I'm gonna just stop. Uh, so anyway, we only need one more flower. We're not gonna be getting it for a while, though. Uh, and you'll see what happens. Again, it's required. You have to do this. Because if you don't, you can't beat the game and Bowser will win. The end. Uh, if you want to use the Toad House, you have to kill the Shy Guy on the bed. Let's do so. And let's take a nap. Because naps are nice. I probably should have cut this out, but I guess I forgot. Whatever, naps are awesome. And as you'll see here, if we go to try to use the post office. Stop, thief. Oh, mailbag is gone. So we can't use the post office until we get the mailbag back. So we better go do that. Um, let's see. Uh, over and one more thing over here. We have uh, dictionary is stolen from uh, Ru Rusty. Uh, we haven't really even talked to him yet. He's a, an information guy, basically. Uh, here, if you want to use this shop, you have to kill the shy guy uh, who is uh, running the store. Um, since it's not really his store. Ow! Poor me. Or no, oh no, poor me. Mario, way to show the little hooligan a thing or two. <sighs> okay, so then, uh, one more thing to show, I think, is... Oh wait, no, two more things. Uh, we have, if you go to Luigi, uh, he'll be chasing a shy guy. I don't think there's really... I don't think killing the shy guy really does anything in here. I'm just showing it because I can. Because um, I think you could still do everything you can do in Mario's house without killing the shy guy. 
but he's gone. So now all the shy guys are gone from the village, but all the stuff that was stolen is still stolen. And we need to get the shy guy's toy box, which we're still not sure where that is. So, Mario. Do 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 do. It's Twink. Mario, Mario. Good to see you. We found out that you defeated Tablaba. I knew you could do it. I just knew it. When we heard the news, the princess was very relieved. Oh yes, I've got new new information about the Honorable Star Spirits who are still imprisoned. Have you ever heard of Shy Guy's Toy Box? It seems that one of the Honorable Star Spirits is being held there, but where on earth is Shy Guy's Toy Box? I have no idea. And that's what we will be finding out next time. So this has been Mega Freak 400 reminding you to go dance.